so far What's up guys? guys? I'm Zach. I'm Morgan. And today we're he's going to be reacting to things girls do but won't admit. And also he is a little bit sick, so yeah. he doesn't really want to talk that much. So that's why I'm gonna be reading them off and he's just gonna react, react to them. But <clears throat> alright, so you ready? Okay. Oh <laughs> I try to get on my phone in the backwards. Okay. So the first thing is girls wear the same bra every day. That's a little weird. You think it was like normal though? Not really. Why? I always wear the same thing over and over. Because not over. enough. Go buy more. They're expensive. That's weird. Okay. It's not normal. The second thing that girls do, but won't admit, is like check, like stretch, so that you can smell your armpits. What? <laughs> like do this, like pretend to stretch, so you can smell your armpits. <laughs> Come what? on, I know you do that. I know you've done that. I haven't. I know. Do you guys do that out there? Is that like, is that a thing? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I'll do it. <laughs> Either that or I'll just. I want to smell my air armpits. I'll just smell my armpits. I'm not going to sit there and play it off. Like, yeah, but I mean, like, stretch. I mean, you don't want to just go. Like that, like that just looks weird. Just, just stretch. Well, but I don't even do that. I just stick my hand under there and smell my hand. <laughs> <It's> so weird. <laughs> yeah, my voice sounds different if you can't tell. Okay, what? so another thing is, okay, just also a disclaimer. I don't do all of these things. I'm just on a random website, so I don't even know if girls actually do this because I don't do most of these things, but yeah. So the third thing is spray perfume on their partner's pillows before they leave. You think that was normal? I don't mean. I don't do that. Nor no. do I even really like. But I don't know. I don't know what to say about that one. Okay. The what the numbers is four? Yeah. Okay, the fourth thing is we iron our clothes with hair straighteners. I mean, I'd say it's kind of genius in a way. I do it sometimes. I don't even like iron my clothes. In a it's way. like a part of it. If you don't have an cool. ironer, then you know it's kind of an ironer. An ironer. An iron. Ironer. It's uh, not called an ironer. It's called an iron. <laughs> well, an iron. <laughs> I know it's called an iron, but I was just kind of make time make like a little another word for it. But I mean, if you don't have one of those irons. Then it's kind of smart, I guess. I don't know. I mean, it's not weird. I think it's kind of normal. Maybe. Yeah, I think I do it. Normal for some people. Another thing is we, whenever we go to the bathroom, if there's no toilet paper, we use like a cotton pad. Because <laughs> there's no more toilet paper. I've never done that. If I'm out of toilet paper, I just use like a dirty towel and throw it in the What? <laughs> That's worse. And then I throw it in the dirty clothes and like go wash it. Well, if nobody's home to bring me toilet paper, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. That's worse. I don't think so. That's way worse than well, a cotton towel. You just throw them things away. <laughs> but if you use an actual towel... That's weird. Really exposing myself out here today. That's weird. That's not normal. That just, that's not normal. If anything, I know this is like things that girls would like, whatever. But me, um, personally, if it was me, I'd use a tissue. A tissue. If I had to, I'd use a tissue. If you have a tissue. I mean, there's usually tissues there. Well, I'm not gonna use like cotton, something, whatever you said. Cotton pad, like a you know, cotton like, pad. You know the things that I like wipe off my face with. Yeah, 
I'm not gonna use that. But anyways. Well, okay. So another thing is, um, peeing in the shower. It's normal. See, okay. Every other video I've seen, people have said that's gross, but I do it every night. I mean, that's normal. Do you? I've done it before, but. See, I do it literally every night. I think I'm normal. It's normal. normal. Like, I don't it's, think it's, it's just gross. like. Now, if you put it this way, say if you were to like be inside of a pool and you pee inside okay, the pool. Okay, that's not a shower. But no, listen, listen. But if you're, but but look at it this way, like people's gonna think it's weird one end, but they're gonna think it's normal one end. Like say if you're inside the pool and you pee, it's not weird. But if you're standing outside the pool and you pee inside the pool, then it's weird. It's weird if you pee in a pool in general. That's gross. You're swimming in your pee. But no, but you, do you get what I'm saying though? Because you know people pee in pools. You know people do that. Like, you just, like, people are too lazy. I don't anything. pee in the pool, but I'll pee in the ocean. But, but everybody pees in the ocean. Okay, well, then say if you do that. Then say if you just straight up go up to the ocean and you pee, like, you're standing on land and you just <laughs> you pee in the ocean. Because everybody can see you peeing. Nobody knows if you're in the water. Okay, well, the same thing with the pool, though. Yeah, unless they have that, like, inside the, thing. If, like, it's weird to pee inside of a pool, but it's not as weird if you're inside the pool and you pee in it. But if you're outside the pool and you pee into the pool, then it's, I don't know if you guys get what I'm saying, but it's, it's just weird. I think it's just weird. But the shower thing, I don't know, it's just, it's all going down the drain anyway, so I mean, it's all going to the same place, I think. That was a very long explanation yeah. for not peeing in the shower is normal. <laughs> oh, okay. Man. So another thing is um, dry shampoo overload, like... If girls like don't have time to wash their hair and it's greasy and they just put a bunch of dry shampoo in it, but they keep doing it instead of washing their hair. I don't know what that means. They're not washing their hair. No. Oh. And do you think that's gross? I mean, in a way. I don't use dry way. shampoo because I heard that it can like make your hair fall out, and my hair falls out enough as it is. In a way, it's weird. In a way, it's not. I don't know. I think it's gross. I would rather, I would much rather not be lazy and just wash my hair. My hair, I don't wash my hair, but every other night, and it doesn't even get greasy until the second day, anyways. So, mm -hmm. but okay, using old, reusing old razor. No, it's normal. Like if it's rusted. Oh, if it's rusted, then no. Yeah, I don't. No, if it's rusted, then no, definitely not. Okay, so another thing is making a wall mural with stray hairs in the shower. That's weird. I I think that's gross. I don't do that. I just let it. I just take it and let the water rinse it down the drain. That's completely gross. That's not normal at all. That's a disgusting, and I've heard so, so many people that say they do that. Yeah. So. Yeah, yeah that's not normal. Okay. Um. If you, there's like a stubble in your armpit and they play with it. <laughs> <laughs> I've never done that. I don't even know what that means. It's kind of weird. <laughs> Girls shouldn't have hair on their armpits, first of all. Well, we do. Well, I'm talking about like that, like no, straight. like a stubble, like a little, I don't know what a stubble means. What is a stubble? <laughs> <laughs> it just, it's weird. It's weird. That's all we got to say about that. It's weird. No, it's not normal. Picking outfits out based on how hairy your legs are. Oh. I do that. Like, <laughs> like in the summer, like I won't wear shorts or ripped jeans. Well, I'll probably wear ripped jeans, but I wouldn't wear shorts. Mm. Like I would just wear like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's, I don't really know how I feel about it. Picking your nose. <laughs> It's gross, but everybody's <laughs> done it. Everybody's done it. It's gross. Have you done like, it recently? No. Oh. <laughs> you have, though? Yeah. Huh? Recently. It's gross. Well, sometimes it's like it's up in there. Like, you feel it, and like when you breathe, you feel it moving, but then like, you can't blow no, it out. that's gross, bro. Like, you can't blow it out, so you just gotta get, like, and you can't get a tissue, so you just gotta get your finger and just scratch it out of there. And then you go wash your hands and you throw it away. Throw the little booger away. Just 
to wash your hands. That's gross. <laughs> the way you said it is just ugh. Okay. So mm. another one is pulling out a long hair of a very interesting place of your body. So like pulling a hair out of your butthole. <laughs> Chill out, that's <laughs> nasty. Wait, I, I, what else are you supposed to do? Just leave it there? It's just nasty. No, like, cause sometimes when you're in the shower, it's not like you can help it. It's like, sometimes you're in the shower, and you know, your hair gets like, you get stray hair, and your hair like falls out a little bit. And it just, it somehow, not sure how it does this, but it gets a long way from home, and it ends up in your butt hole, and you just gotta pull it out. Okay. That's weird. <laughs> um, using expired makeup. I don't know anything about makeup. I don't even think I use expired makeup. I only know a little bit about makeup from when that last video is when I did her makeup. When James Charles was here. Yeah, I, I really don't, I don't know a thing about makeup. So if I used expired makeup, I wouldn't be able to tell the difference. I feel like it would be like clumpy. I don't know. I feel like it wouldn't go on there, right? So the last one is peeling off nail polish instead of just using nail polish remover. That's that's all right. It's not it's not weird. I don't. I use. I get gel nails, so my my gel stuff just peels off, and I usually peel them off in the shower. If anything is more satisfying. If anything. That's going to be it for today's video, guys. Uh, I'm sorry if I act a little down. My voice, I'm kind of sick. I have a cold, really bad headache, throat issues. But um, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. Turn them post notifications on. That way you get notified every single video. And um, comment down below if you guys like if you guys uh, liked what we did here. Um, and subscribe. How that feel? I didn't feel anything. Anyways, what did I do? You hit your finger on. Oh. <laughs> I didn't even feel it. Anyways, guys, if you did enjoy this video, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. Smash uh, 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 subscribe button. Peace. Bye.